not me being consistent welcome back to another weekly vlog y'all just got back from mexico yesterday night back home looking like Rah. but i'm in my makeshift office you know i've been spending the most of the day here just getting caught up on things receipts and whatnot looking at how much money i've spent in the past <laughs> So it is. Um, I'm having some dinner. It's just a salad because y'all, um, if you watched my vlog, which you will see the, the Mexico solo birthday vacation vlog before you see this one. Of course, this one won't be out in prob until probably Sunday at the earliest, but most likely Monday. And I'm holding y'all. I don't have you on the little thingy thing. It's gonna charge you too, even though you're pretty darn charged. So I think I can get away with it uh, for the next two to three days. But um, you're gonna see the Mexico vlog. I'm just doing a rough, rough edit right now. You know, like real, real rough, like no music yet. And then, yeah, so. Y'all will be getting that. I'm just kind of kind of loosely editing it while eating this salad. But like I said, y'all, it's time to get on my healthy-ish because like, I'm a bad bitch now, period. Don't, don't, don't do me. Don't do me. Like also this is a very cute combo. Can we not talk about it? How cute this is? I got this. I need to create an Amazon store because I keep on telling y'all a free game. I'm not making a dime off of things that I buy every day for myself, but we're gonna work on that. But, uh, ooh, one sec, let me pull my stuff down. Cause I'll be, I'll be looking like a bum, but I'll be icy. Uh, so yeah, I got this JBW watch. I forgot what it's called, um, but it was a gift to myself. And then this bracelet here is a Kate Spade bracelet. I wanted, so I wanted to get the Hermes, like um, buckle bracelet thing. You know the one, the one that's like white ceramic and it has the H. I wanted that, the the thinner one, but I didn't want to spend $600. That's just kind of the simple part. So I found a very similar kind of idea bracelet, even though it's a little, it's thinner than thinner, um, with Kate Spade and I got it off of Amazon. Um, sorry, got it off of Amazon for like 40 bucks. And it's really cute. Hopefully, I'm gonna hold myself accountable. I created an Amazon store between now and when y'all see this so that y'all can shop on it. Cause like, I like to, you know, get things. I think you are gonna get a better sense of my fashion um, once you see the vlog. And as I get healthier and start feeling more comfortable with showing my body and whatnot, you'll really see kind of what my fashion sense is. Cause I, I just can't lie to y'all and say that I feel amazing in my body right now. I don't, um, yeah, I don't. And that's for stories later on when we get to know each other a little bit more. If you've watched some of my older vlogs and you gotta get a sense of when the weight gain started and the kind of reason for why. But I think that I'm in this place where, of complete elevation where I'm elevating not only my entrepreneur, business, creative side, but my health and confidence and being the bad bitch full on, like dressing up more. Like, I, I kid you not y'all, I will wear this sweat all day long and be fine. But like, that's not what y'all wanna see with on in like in, in reels. You don't wanna see a bitch wearing sweats every single day um, in them, that, that doesn't inspire you. Um, but it's my reality. It's what I've grown really comfortable, comfortable being the key word that I'm trying to break out from um, into a new chapter. So yeah, but like I said, I just got back from Mexico yesterday and then I'm getting on a flight tomorrow morning, pray for me. It's at seven o'clock in the morning, so I have to leave here at like 5.30 uh, for a work trip. No, it's not to Boston. For those of you who've been watching the vlogs, you know that I've been going to Boston like every other week. But uh, it is for debate. Um, as y'all know, I work for USC and Harvard. Um, so there's a round robin that's happening in Kentucky, a round robin like over the top 
uh, eight teams or so, no, like 10 teams, something like that. Uh, teams in the country go to duke it out like a round robin think of like a whatever that equates to in like sport language um so we'll be there for like two days literally leave tuesday come back friday real quick and then there's like an online tournament so i will bring y'all to that because you know that's what i do uh, i will talk to you later you'll probably see me on the way headed to the airport and working oh whoa i zoomed in that wasn't on purpose, that's ooh, giving you face, giving you face. Um, yeah, talk to y'all later. Yeah, wow, I've been real zoomed in then for a minute. I did not have to give y'all all that I gave. All right, bye. I'm weird. Um, hey y'all, I am in the wonderful state of Kentucky in the city of Lexington, not in Boston this time. Um, I just got finished downloading with the squad. Um, this is the first in-person tournament since February of 2020. Wow, um, more than a year and a half, wild, right? Um, so it's a round robin, so it's a smaller select group of students competing. So that's going to be good. But I thought that I would... Oh, what am I trying to say? Smallest of students, um, the tournament is actually happening in this hotel. We're in the downtown Hilton in Lexington. So I thought before I get ready for bed um, that I would show you all the hotel, do a room tour, because you know I've been doing that. Um, I like this one a lot more than the Boston one. It's a little more newer, if you will. So let me turn on one more light so that y'all can fully see what's being gave here. So let's go to the front and room tour. All right, so we have a door. Yes, to our Left here, we have closet. Love that for me. Oh, another pillow and blanket. Um, what's that called? Steamer thing. I'm wearing sweats the entire day, so better not. To your right, we have the bathroom. What to do? What to do, baby? I'm going to the gym, y'all. Healthy living starts tomorrow. <laughs> um, kind of working out part. The food part's gonna wait till I'm back home. Shower. Yup. Yeah. yeah, so there's not really much to show here. And then here's the room. Got a, I think this is a king size bed. We're on, I'm on the executive floor. Um, USC did that. So we love that for me. Um, you, need like key access to get this floor. So, you know, we love that. This is where a lot of my uploading in terms of, well, yes, the Tulum vlog is going up on Wednesday or Thursday. Really gonna just do it when I feel good to do it. Um, so there's that. A lot of writing that's gonna happen there. And then we have this, it's not much of a view, so it's not really facing the city. It's really kind of facing just stuff but yeah this is the room yay 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 i hope that y'all are appreciating consistent vlogging um really trying to do this 
YouTube thing seriously. And I'm also gonna be filming when I get back home. I just travel for work stuff so much. Uh, but I'm gonna really try to do more non-vlog content. Like I wanna do like life update stuff, um, opinion pieces type stuff. I really wanna figure out what is my voice on this channel? Like what is, what is my niche? Um, who do I speak to? So if you ever feel, you know, moved to talk back in the comment sections, I really do wanna like talk to y'all and like figure out what this community is that I am growing. So yeah, make sure that you subscribe, hit the post notification bell, and we will get into the rest of this vlog. Hey y'all, just coming on to say hello. Not been on the camera all day because I've been working, but it's always when you've been crying all day and decide to just like fake the funk that your makeup comes out phenomenally. Um, so. Did some to real. About to do a staff dinner. This is the look. Get into it, yeah. It. I'm trying to feel better. Makeup right now is my <laughs> my armor. But I will talk to you all probably tomorrow. Bye. Hey y'all, I'm back in Sacramento. I am editing the Tulum vlog. I'm just kind of looking. I'm mapping out the um, the thumbnail because I want it to be pretty, but I'm also like, if you've watched any of like previous videos or you clicked on this one, I usually do like three photos, right? Or it's like all rectangular um, or no. Yeah, it's just like three simple with the word vlog, but I do like some of the um, vlogs that I see when it's like more vacation-y where it's like more of a collage. So there's like m more than three photos. So I'm playing with it, de deciding how I feel. I'm gonna show y'all the time that you see this, you've already seen the vlog, or if you haven't, go watch the Celebration Tulum, Mexico vlog. But so far, this is what I have. Doing all the background scenes. In many ways, y'all, that's enough for me. Almost to a point where I kind of want to get rid of this one and just like let these three do my usual thing. But I'm really going to challenge myself. Um, just try something different this time. But it is October 2nd. So welcome to October. Um, for those of you who are in social media, if you're doing vlogtober, hats off to you. Good luck. I might, um, I definitely have some getting clear with intentions stuff that I want to do today. I also am judging some rounds for debate, even though I just got back from a debate. Oh, where, where I gotta stop, right? Um, also, that's a little bright. Y'all don't wanna see that. Uh, but yeah, happy October, last three months of the year. This is the season. We're niggas throwing checks for no reason. I mean, I wish. No, but I'll talk more about this as I start moving towards working on that stuff with my um, kind of getting clear with my intentions. What are my goals for the rest of the year? How do I want to show up for those? Who do I want to be? All of that stuff um, a little later on. But that's where my mindset is at. And I'm really excited for these last three months. Um, and I hope that y'all are too for yours. But I will talk to you all later. I'm gonna finish getting this YouTube video ready and up to go. It's an hour long. So I hope that y'all watching this back, you enjoyed it. So I'll talk to you when I talk to you next. Mind your business. Okay, bye. Just wanted to keep y'all updated on how it turned out. I think that it turned out pretty good. I'm sorry, but this is a bad bitch picture, okay? Yeah, I like how this turned out. Okay, I'm just so excited for y'all to see this. All right, <laughs> bye. Super B throw fell throughout the economy. Super B's been a critical part of the SEC revolution. SEC will offer fast rates of innovation, diffusion, and that. Really, it's been straight positive feedback. But feedback is possible to avoid other soda evidence pointing towards a tipping point of basic economics. Basic impacts. <laughs> Oh, yeah.
store because I don't know I'm going vegan all October so I need to get some vegan food not me being consistent and turning on my camera and updating all what I'm doing and taking you to the grocery store with me not me being consistent not me doing it all right I'll talk to you all once I'm at Trader Ooh, let me this is my gang sign this is Jasmine sign blah, 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 blah. okay Mom, you consented by giving birth to me. No, I didn't. I, Mom, I did not choose to be here. Oh. So therefore, you still have to ask. Ask me. You've already been on this before, so. Um, I did not give her consent, so I'll let you know that this whole thing is unconsented. She talks about consent, and she said by me giving birth to her, that's consent faulty i didn't choose faulty i didn't choose faulty but we are on the way to the grocery store <sighs> well i'm going vegan for the entire month of october nice so that's straight vegan like no dairy no nothing right? mom vegan like i mean mom that's you know, what vegan means i know sometimes you'd be like you know well, I'm mom, I, mom i've never said i'm going vegan for the entire month Vegan means no cheese. I know that, friend. No dairy cheese. I get it. I well, do you because you be out here going on your uh, Willie's oh, runs? Oh, but you know what? Huh? That's because I be on, you know, the cycle. And Mom, but Ma, uh, me too. Well, so you can't I'm blame saying, the cycle. Yeah, I can. Yes, I can. No. She'll only get groceries for one week, she said. She's only gonna keep it light, she said. Psych, but tomorrow starts a month of veganism. So I had, I'm, 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 I'm binging. My mom and I were having some Talenti, period. We're having some brioche this looks real freaking good one thing about my mom and i we can commit but we're gonna go down and blaze and glory before we do we got some other stuff i got some salmon i bought a rice crispy treat because i said not today i would do an unboxing but uh or the unboxing show you all everything that i got but i'm gonna be cooking a lot this next month since I'm not traveling as much. So you'll see it as I try it. All the things. So we'll make sure that y'all check out other content that I put out this month. I was thinking about my content map. I think that a cooking one. Cooking one is gonna be part of it. Like a what I eat in a day. I think that, yes. Yes. Um, but I think I'm gonna close out the vlog for this week. It's technically it's Sunday and just keep things all under wraps make sure you comment like subscribe and i will talk to y'all in the next vlog which starts pretty much now
these nights I get drawn into these problems for what? You keep taking my conscience, I can process your love Stuck in my way, missing your tail Hello party people, welcome back to another weekly vlog Consistency Um, as you can see, I just made myself, made myself some breakfast this is a v vegan scone my dark brew coffee as y'all know i'm doing completely vegan this month so this is like an entry level this apparently is really really good so i'm gonna try it i'm gonna break it in half so that y'all can see how moist the moistness that it's giving I'm gonna do it this way so y'all can see what's happening here. Vegan, y'all. Vegan. So, let's. Mmm. Look at how moist. But, while. I guess I can show y'all me doing this. Just because. 2021. Damn yet. Mm, no mind your business but is it going to get done today it sure is and that's on everything period that's on everything period it is happening okay so what are some things that y'all can expect oh we bring y'all up a little bit don't go by double chin yeah that's what we're working on it at the gym or we have not started working on it but i'm gonna start working on it at the gym Oh, if y'all can see, I got new Amazon stuff. Um, I said that I was gonna create an Amazon storefront. So maybe that's what I'll do in this weekly vlog. Before this video goes up, I will do that. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do that. I've got a few videos that I need to upload this week. Got the episode of Talk To, Not At. I'll kind of show y'all a a BTS um, because you know entrepreneur life trying to make something for myself by myself not by myself on a team but yeah so this is what I'm editing currently ignore the broken down screen but Abby and I have really figured out lighting um, with all of the let's see can I do no, 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 no. Make it lot big screens so that y'all can see. Y'all can really appreciate that. That you do not have the atonic, like the anatomical ability to bring yourselves into one same population. Like you are so different mm -hmm. that you naturally have separation. Or gen she's getting into biological racism. She's got a degree in biology. If you're not familiar, the talk to not at show, it's not a podcast yet. Right now, we're just kind of piloting on um, just YouTube. I think we will transition it to also being a podcast to further our reach. Um, but for now, I think it it being a, a, a show on YouTube works. But it's called Talk To Not At, important conversations dissecting political, social um, issues from like TikTok to politics through a lens of um, critical race theory and science, the intersections of those, and her being a bad bitch, let's be real. Um, having those conversations, like she's gonna have conversations about like what it means to be mixed, right? Like having that conversation um, and not being the mixed girl. It's like, <laughs> I'm just like a cosmopolitan. We don't, we don't care. Um, and I produce it, so like I do all the editing. I put like in, I invest in everything that goes in the background of it. So from like the iPad that y'all see to the candle, to the placement of the mug, all of that stuff. Like I, that's where my role is. We outline every single week for like what the episode is. Today I'm dropping episode at two o'clock. I have to edit this one because we've had some issues with like figuring out how to send properly um, files, but we figured it out. So now no. No issues there. So, you know, transformation happens now. Transformation, everything that you want in 2022 starts with who you choose to be and how you choose to act in 2021. 
right now. So if you needed that kind of message to get your butt up and like doing something or really kind of looking at yourself and asking what ignites your soul, then this is that message. Let's go. Um, so I'll do that. I'm going to be filming. I'm going to take myself out to dinner either Friday or Saturday. Don't know. I'm going to see if there's any movies out because that might be like the combo or it'll be movies one day taking myself out to dinner the next really want to implement some more self-care um and just doing things for me um staycations all that good stuff but this weekend it's just going to be going out to dinner um and whatever else oh um i'm going to be doing um i'm going to be filming a lot more like me cooking so those are going to be separate videos like outside of like if it's like this is not like an important meal i'm just gonna like show in the vlog but because i am doing this vegan thing i am going to be doing more dedicated content to that because i do like to cook i enjoy it and i'm excited for what consistency and focusing on what i put in my body more um intentionally will do yeah long time we'll be talking i'm gonna get off um if you're interested in all those things that are to come definitely subscribe and keep watching the vlog all right y'all hey y'all taking a little break the episode oop, just got finished um like i edited it and it's up and it's gonna be going up about five o'clock it's three o'clock right now that's if it goes up today and that's because if you were not living under a rock and you don't have like attachment issues like yourself myself um, Facebook, Instagram, WhatsApp, all of that has gone down for the past like all day um, until now 309. So a lot of my things that I wanted to get done today were on social media. So I just kind of like, oh, well, and like part of marketing is using social media. This is where email, email marketing, they're not wrong. They're not wrong. Um, so I'm starting to get creative about how I want to market the things uh to get out to people so i might just really sit down and ask myself like what is an email marketing strategy because clearly it's needed when social media goes down but what i just made which i'll know like i you just saw me talk about being vegan for a month like going straight for it i'm going to show you more in depth here we have black beans i seasoned them with yellow curry agave onion powder cayenne pepper salt pepper that kind of stuff have some cilantro have vegan sour cream underneath here maybe you can't see it brown rice is like the base then i have avocado right over here with some siete green pepper sauce like avocado sauce and some sweet chili sauce uh, over it we're gonna see if it's a hit or if it's not it literally took maybe five or 10 minutes to make the beans I had to cook or like defrost in season. <laughs> Wait. Y'all. Ooh, not the noise. Mm. Y'all this? This lap. This uh, lap. Mm hmm. And like how I did the beans. It's got no sauce in it. This good. This is real good. All right, y'all, I'm back. Wow, I was really trying to figure out if my camera was broken and if I had to quit life. But turns out I just had to consult Google. Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to. I was actually concerned. I was like, well, this has been fun. Can we appreciate the makeup though, y'all? These lashes go off. They're so easy to put on. Um, they're from Viva La Breeze Beauty. I did not link her business on the Tulum vlog. I'll link it in this vlog because they're literally goals. Like feathery, easy. She's got a lot of different styles and they're so easy to put on. I do not do well putting on lashes. So this was the goat. I'm making the spaghetti. It's this, y'all saw it the most recent, cooking down. This is all vegan, mind you. Oops, sorry, let me not drop you in the spaghetti. But yeah, this is all vegan. You know, I'm doing a month of veganism. But I'm about to put the sauce in and I will show y'all the finished product. 
when it's done. I'm just looking at my makeup like bust down, Katiana. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Don't be me and drink coffee at 9 o'clock at night. But the spaghetti is done. I'm gonna hold it like this so y'all can get a kind of view of it up close. Real excited for this. Why is the screen a little? There we go. And then I made some garlic bread, but it's just avocado toast with garlic. A lot of garlic in this dish. But I'm gonna eat this, watch shots of sunset, and probably go to bed. Bye, y'all. to say that I'm still alive. It's been a hard, hard <laughs> few days. And ignore that light thing, we need to get that fixed. But still my plant-based stuff. I got some junk food. Cause you know, just because you're vegan does not mean necessarily everything's healthy. But um, today it's gonna be an unhealthy vegan day. And if you didn't know, now you know. Oreos are vegan. So I, didn't, I didn't get my nails done yet because I canceled that because like I said, today's been a hard, hard day. So I'm gonna eat some Oreos with some chub. Y'all, y'all. Y'all like it? If you ain't drinking this, <laughs> what are you doing? You need to drink this. That's my aunt, I'm gonna go. I'll show you when I get my junk for my um, takeout. Maybe we can start. All right. Bye. I've secured the goods, y'all. DoorDash, you know, home of the spend too much money because, yeah. I went to this place called Burger Patch. I'm getting everything out so I can show you this. Not my first time. <laughs> Won't be my last, but this is what it looks like. I think they've got a Bay Area location. I'm not too sure, but it's called Burger Patch. I got their Sud Fries. It's like, hmm. It's like their version of, okay, let me do this so that y'all can actually see. I'm not be lazy. This is their Spud Fries. I'm gonna heat these up. It's like a animal fries. They could've given me some more onions, but you know. And then I got regular fries, cause you know, I'm on that time of the month. So potatoes are my friend, and I got a burger. The burgers are good, they're sausage set. So yeah, I'm going to finish eating this and talk to you all later. Bye.